Usually we have a lot to say about DC on this channel, but today we're going to talk about DC animation, so it's probably going to be okay. <laughs> we always put a, like a little bit. <laughs> probably. <laughs> probably. You never know. You, you, you never know. James Gunn is over there. So we gotta... yeah. Today we're going to be taking a look at Justice League Crisis. Correct me if I'm wrong, Leo. Justice League Crisis is comic series where there's basically multiple version it's kind of like a like a multiversal type of thing yep. for dc right if i did, yep. are remembering correctly okay cool. yeah yeah it, it's it's basically it's it's basically the, the the dc version of which they actually did it first so it's basically their version of multiverse of multiverse okay because i know there's different <laughs> versions of different characters floating around so i saw that in yeah. the trailer there's like two different yeah. supermen and stuff like that i'm like all right you know, yeah, check, check it out. You know, but DC it's animation, yeah, DC <laughs> animation. You know, it's usually, uh, yeah. But you know. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't I don't know either. Know. I don't know either, man. I don't know either. Anyway, I gotta, uh, gotta let's, see it. Let, let's let's take a look. It's a quick teaser trailer, forty seconds. Let's see what DC's got in the animation department. Most of you are aware that you live in a reality parallel to many versions of your universe. I've gathered you all to save your world. Is it as bad as it looks? Yes. You're needed, Kara. Something's about to happen. Something major. The universe. It's all vanishing. Quick, quick to the point. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Right. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh God, no. Leo sounds okay. upset. Yeah. Okay. So I, 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 I'm not a fan of this animation style. I. You know what? I'm glad you said something because I don't know what it is, but the last we did another DC trailer a while ago. And they've changed to this like newer animation style. Yeah, that looks like very. And again, I don't, I don't know what this is rated, so I, I didn't really catch if it's rated. Maybe it's, it's supposed to be more kid cartoony like, and that's cool if that's what they're going for. But it's Infinite Crisis. You can't. But well, it's well, it's it, well, it's Crisis. It's not Infinite Crisis. It's Crisis. That's what they labeled it. But they should <laughs> fucking say Infinite Crisis because it's fucking every damn version of them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, and it's a three. My thing is, if it was a three-part movie, movie I, event, I, a movie event, I'm assuming that that means three parts, at least an hour and a half each. Right. So uh, my thing is, it's probably not specifically directed at kids. It's probably meant for adults as well. It's probably rated PG-13, but oh god, don't do that. No, nah, it probably is. I want to be honest with you, but uh, this animation style, I don't know what it is, but I, yeah, what is up with the naked women? I'm not mad at it, but I'm okay. <laughs> It's not naked. <laughs> she has a costume on. What do you mean? What? What? what, what, what okay. <laughs> yeah, she does. Yeah. Okay. What? <laughs> Shit. All right. What? What character is this? I do. I do not know. That I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know who this is. Neither. I don't know none of these. And I don't. I don't want to sound stupid to some DC. But she looks. Like she is a Green Lantern, though. I was gonna say she looks like a Green Lantern, but I didn't want to be negligent in saying that. That's yeah, and I don't know. I don't know none of the other. This looks like it. Movie. This looks like it's a version of Fate. I think I would assume because of the helmet, right? Because of the helmet. I, again, I'm assuming. I don't really know, but and the two in the back, I can't really make them out well enough. To. Yeah, I can't make out the two in the back. One looks like Supergirl. The one up top. Yeah, but she wearing pink though. Yeah, but she, and she's shooting. Let's see. You know what? This uh, it reminds me of that FX show of uh, the spy FX show. It was oh, a cartoon. Uh, Reacher, or Re like, yeah. not Re Reacher, not Reacher. It was um. Reacher. Oh, fuck is that? What is that cartoon on FX? It's by James Bond. Archer, 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 Archer. Yes, Archer. Archer. Thank you, not Reacher. That's what it reminds me of. It's a hundred percent just like Archer. It looks just like it. It's funny that you said that because I, I was a hey, Reacher, Archer. Yeah, yeah, I got you. I never watched Archer, but you know, but this animation style is just very like 
it's new school. It's very, very new school. You know this, I mean? see, this came out, this right here came out good because you're mixing with the two with the background. I don't know if it was just that Superman scene. It could have been. Yeah, yeah it could have been for sure. Because, um, yeah, you got Blue Beetle. Yeah, okay. This is, um, um, God, I'm so fucking, I'm so bad with, I'm so um, bad with, DC, with names. DC names, bro. So am I. Uh, what the hell is, is that? Um, oh, Jesus fucking Christ. I it's, gonna come, it's, it's gonna, yeah, it's gonna it's come to me. It's gonna figure kill me. Yeah, of course, it's fine. Um, but either way, I mean, like, I get it. Like, different di parallel universes on top of you see, know, yeah, look with each other. Da, da, da. You, you see the difference? It. One is uh, one looks like Archer, the other one looks more more detailed. Yeah, the yeah. one in the background looks like a younger version. This one looks like an older version, has more detail. The other, the younger one looks like Archer, and then yeah. you have Hawkman. Blue in the back, Batgirl, Batgirl Batman. You're gonna uh, see like every character in these. Episodes. Yeah, Green Arrow. You have a yeah. You have a, almost everybody back there. And why is this Flash so worried when you can literally bend <laughs> through time and Look, space? John Stewart. John, it's both both freaking Green Lanterns. Oh my god! Both Green Lanterns. That is kind of dope. Yeah, I'm in. The Bat looks cool. Even like the action scenes to me just looked a little wonky. I'm not really trying to hate, but they just look a little wonky. You know what yes. I mean? Yes. You see, there goes the Archer scene again. No money. Why does this Flash know how to run? <laughs> Wait, his arms ain't all the way up? No. Sure? They're straight in front of you like they're supposed to fucking run. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. The Batwing. Are we going to get a Batman 2099? Oh, that I mean, cool. uh, no, Bat, uh, uh, Batman, Batman Beyond. Yeah, Batman Beyond. Yeah. I would hope so. That'd be cool. Wait, go back a little bit. Oh, um, God, what is her name? <laughs> Jesus Christ, I always give us some of these names. I know her name. That's Santana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. It's something with a Z. That's all. Yeah, I know. Santana. Yeah, I see the Z right there on the other thing. Oh God, what is this guy's name? Supergirl. Like what the hell is Batman fighting here? Yeah, dude. Uh, it's a shadow, bro. The, the, yeah, exactly. That's not going to work. Batterings ain't going. Not enough prep time, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, why like, do you look so nervous? I mean, like, yeah, it seems to me like I'm, I'm curious as to why the Flash is so nervous because he's the one who can really, like, manipulate the time travel and stuff, right? Yeah. He's so fast. But, I mean, I don't know. Okay, so we got... And then all of a sudden, all the universes are disappearing. Yeah, with all the planets. So it should be Infinite Crisis. They just named it Crisis. Don't ask me why. Why the hell is Lois Lane all over the goddamn place? <laughs> Wait, these, on these infinite, still, uh, Crisis these, on Infinite Earth. On Infinite Earth. Okay, Earth, so they named it Crisis on Infinite Earth. Why these films, you... these films are not yet rated. I haven't given them a rating yet. I'm telling you, PG-13. I'm telling you, watch. Oh God, please don't. <laughs> oh see, man, see, WB and this. DC. You don't know, do you, guys, you, you guys, you guys. Listen, this. listen. I really, I, I can already just see the comments. I can smell them already. <laughs> it's gonna be Marvel fans who hate on DC, but hear me out. DC has always had Marvel beaten animation, and I'm not gonna lie to you. I, J Leo, hear me out on this. X Men '97 comes out, and it kills, and this sucks. We got competition. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I'm talking about new school. Don't don't talk to me about new, DC okay, old school okay, animation. Okay. DC old school animation, unbeat, unbeat. Okay, so, so start from now to yeah. see what we're going. I'm saying 2020. And 2024 moving forward. Say what you want about yeah. Marvel and having their if you they have issue, blah, blah blah. And people have told me the Groot animated series is good. What if yeah, I, like, I actually kind of like it? What, <laughs> I don't what know if, why I'm just a big ass kid. <laughs> what if what if is pretty fucking yeah, good? For what if it's Mar fire. Marvel Zombies? Pretty fucking good. good. Fucking good now again. the next one, now the next one we're getting is X-Men 97, which come on, we're all waiting for X-Men Exactly. Everybody's you know, uh, is, this hey, is dying breath now. This is like and DC's Infinite Crisis is not good. Competition moving forward for animation, better animation. Just saying. Yeah. 
Now, I can't argue. I can't argue that. I can't. Now, X-Men 97 it, has to knock it, it out of the park. Did they but, bring out anything else but this? An animation hey, we, style? We covered another animation that came out, I want to say, earlier this year, but it went right to, to Blu-ray, DVD, digital, hmm. or whatever. I'm assuming it's on Max as well. I can't remember the name of the movie. All I remember is that it was DC, this same animation style, this archery animation style. Shit. And it had like, uh, you, you remember, I don't remember, the, it had like cowboys in it, stuff like that. I don't remember, I can't remember what the name of the movie was. I'm not going to lie to you. Okay. I, I could try I'm gonna look. I'm gonna look it up. I'll look, I'm gonna but, look it up. We'll figure we'll get but, more. But more either way, this seems this seems like the way WB is going with their animation moving forward. So to me, unless this is a really really good movie or trilogy, they're calling it a trilogy. Yeah, whatever. this is a three trilogy, parter. Yeah, okay. This is a three parter. Unless this this trilogy is fucking insane, Marvel can actually catch up animation department. Telling yeah, you, it'll never be old school DC because I'm telling you, yeah. I watched a little bit. I just went back and watched some Batman Beyond the other day, and I was like, Yeah, <laughs> yeah. The, dude, the storyline, bro. The story is the storyline is fucking ridiculous on Batman Beyond. That's what and I'm saying. The ghost and and the freaking Joker who laughs. You'll never beat <laughs> those old DC animations. <laughs> You'll never catch up to the, to those. But if you're talking from 2023 to 2024, yeah. and then we got what if coming out. Mm -hmm. What if comes out in December? X Men's gonna be at some point early next year, we think. Earliest next year. And I mean, DC, this is all you offering me is a this is what movie. You, you're telling me this and X Men '97 come out at the same time ish, give or take. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. Just saying. Yo, I, see, this, see, this is a conversation that we were having with freaking James Gunn and, and, and Zack Snyder. If they keep doing the same times, bro. Saying it's it's gonna be rough for, for DC, bro. Huh? It's gonna be rough, bro. It's gonna be because if you you haven't hit yet, you got Aquaman coming out, but everybody already knows where we're going with that one. Yep. So I I don't know, and I'm root. I want them to win, dude. I there's nothing more that I want is more nerd shit. I but, can't even, no, same. And I and I want and I hate the fact that people just I I I know this is supposed to be a trailer reaction and it, it will be and it's right. not gonna ramble too long, but I hate the fact that people think that we just hate DC. We don't, we want DC to be good. I say yes. this constantly. Yes. I, I want both DC and Marvel to succeed and be good because we love those these characters. It's not hate to hate, it's hate because they haven't given us anything to love. I want to yeah, love it, things, you know what I mean? It, like it, <laughs> this is the same thing when everybody started saying, okay. Uh, Leo, how do you feel about the Joker, the the last Joker movie? I was like, dude, I put him with my three joke, my four Jokers is uh, uh, I always forget the 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 series, early the one. early early series. Of, I think it's Gonzalez. I don't want to make mess up his name. Uh, uh, Jack Nicholson, uh, Heath, and uh, Joaquin. Joaquin Phoenix. Joaquin Phoenix. Yeah, I, he. Those are my top four. Joaquin Phoenix always. Joker was sadistic. It was, yes, it was, it was crazy for a movie that didn't have a lot of. They had a not a lot of action and just talking, mm -hmm. and it showed you the 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 progression of Joker and how insane he was. Yeah, great. Yep. But it's DC elsewhere. DC elsewhere. That's it. And we're getting a, a a follow up that's supposed to be a musical sequel with Lady Gaga. Cool. <sighs> <laughs> that's what I mean, DC. Like that's that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm. See my problem, <sighs> and I don't want to hate. Maybe it'll be good. Maybe the second Joker movie will be good. I'm I hope it's not it. a fucking musical, bro. Please. Well, maybe it's not a musical. Maybe it has musical elements in it, quote unquote. That's what they're saying. So, you know, whatever. But either way. All right. We've rambled too long. Yes. Let us know your thoughts on Justice League Crisis on Infinite Earths. This is the first part of the trilogy coming out in 2024. Don't know if they're going to put out all three parts. Maybe at three different points next year, possibly. I have no idea how much it's done. Um, but Infinite Crisis itself, great story. Let's see if they can do it well in animation. So. Oh, and also a question for you guys down in the comments. 2023, 2024, DC versus Marvel in animation. Oh, boy. Yeah. Answer. Wh which one? Are Answer truthfully. X-Men 97 or like stuff like this from DC with Crisis? Like where would you rather? Like what's got you more hype? And you also <laughs> have what if? Well, what if comes out this year? So, but yeah, you're, you're right. 23, you're right. 23 24. Right. Late, late 23 into 24. Yeah, it's fair. fair. Come on. Fair. You, let me know. Let me fair. know what you guys want. Let me know. Let, let me just yeah. let me know. I just want to know where you guys land at. 
Let us know your thoughts on that below. And as usual, quick spiel. I'm just going to run through it real quick. Thank you guys so much. We are now over 500 subscribers, growing every day. But now your boys are not satisfied with 500. We need 1,000. Let's go. <laughs> yes. So please click the like and subscribe button below. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Please check us out on all forms of social media. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, Twitch, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Kick and Rumble. For all your viewing and listening needs. Oh, next trailer reaction. Deuces. Peace.